Oh my gosh, guys, look how good she's gotten. Hi everybody and welcome back to the second episode of my Star Sign Legacy playthrough. I am so excited to be back playing this series. I feel like it has been ages since I filmed the first part, but I just wanted to say before we jump into things today, thank you so much for all of your love and support on my first episode. It really means a lot because I did spend a lot of time working on that one. So I hope you guys stick around and enjoy the rest of this series. But we are back today with Rain. Obviously, last time we had just learned that we got into our university in Mount Komorebi. So basically, the first thing that needs to happen is we need to pack up and move to Mount Komorebi. Now, Rain has already said goodbye to her brother and everyone, so she does not need to say any more goodbye. She just needs to pack up and move. So I'm going to bring her straight over to her room and get all of her photos of the wall and we're also going to pop our laptop in our inventory as well okay and the last thing I want to do is just hello is to delete the furniture in her room and pop in a little bit of a nursery for the new baby coming along and then I think we'll be ready to set off to Mount Komorebi okay so I've just popped in a little bit of a crib and a chair the rest of it I've kept really empty and basic because we need the money to move into our new house but now that we have picked up all of our belongings I think it's time for us to head off so we'll come say goodbye to our good friend Stephanie bye okay <laughs> and it's time for us to finally split from our household and move Okay, I'm gonna take all of the money because they, the family won't spend it, they won't need it. So we'll take 20,000 simoleons. Oh guys, I feel some sort of way about this, honestly. It's so sad leaving our brother, but I'm excited for the journey ahead. All right, we're heading over now to Mount Komorebi and we will be moving to this lot right here. It is a tiny home, perfect for us. And I can't wait to show you guys this little house. We'll be taking it furnished and our remaining funds are going to be almost 2,000 simoleons, so luckily we can afford it. Oh, here we are. We've arrived in Mount Komorebi. This is our new home that we are moving into. Now, this house here was actually built by one of my good friends. Not my fish on YouTube or my fish died man on Twitter and other social medias. I'll quickly show you guys in the gallery. So here is the house on the gallery. Look how cute it is. So it is My Fish Died Man on Origin if you guys want to check out their other builds. But honestly, I was so, so, so blessed because they actually built this place just for me for this challenge. So I think Rain is absolutely going to love it because this house was built especially for her. <laughs> She's already come inside to do her homework, which is amazing. But I'll give you guys a quick house tour before we get into things. So as you saw earlier, this is the outside of the house. We have a little bit of a bike to get around. And over here, we have ourselves a little bit of a gym area where she can do her boxing and do some meditation to calm down her hot headness. We've also got this really cute mailbox that I've actually never used before. So that was a really exciting to see and a garbage can. Coming inside here, we have a little couch area for us to sit on. For some reason, my fish died man placed a pot plant here, but instead, um, I don't know, something happened in my game and the little pushing vacuum appeared, but uh, well, it's cute anyway. And then on this side, we have our little kitchen with a little plant and of course a bathroom next door, next to it. If we come through here, we have our little table where we can sit and eat and enjoy company with some friends. And then heading upstairs is our bedroom, which I absolutely love. We can pop our laptop that we brought over on this table right here. And we have plenty of room to display our photos of all of our friends, which I am so happy about. Here we go. Oh, perfect. Look, all our photos up in our bedroom. I absolutely love that. And I'm also going to pop our acceptance letter over here. So that's the inside of the house. And then outside is just as cute as the inside. We have our little backyard area. We've got this little water feature over here, which is super cute. I love the bunny. And then on the side, we have a little bit of a spot to hang out with some of our friends. As you guys pointed out in my comment section, Aries do love to socialize. However, they do prefer to bring people over to the house and have like board game nights, etc. So I thought this was a really good 
spot to bring our friends and hang out when we want to have those social gatherings. But for now, Rain is just settling in to her new home in Mount Komarevi. I am looking around and I'm absolutely loving the view. I also think our welcome wagon has arrived, but I don't have a little welcome wagon option, so I have no idea what's going on. <laughs> I guess we'll just come say hi. Rain is getting up and she's going to come and invite her neighbors inside. We have Jana and we've also got her husband Kato over here. I don't think I've ever interacted with this family in my own game before, so it'd be nice to get to know them in this save. Rain knows she has to get her homework done, so she's working on that now. <laughs> I can't believe she's doing it without me telling her to. This is definitely a first. And we also have Kaori over here too. Amazing. Let's come and greet all of our new neighbors. Oh, she's got the pee walk and she's also in her, I think she's in her sleepwear. <laughs> Maybe she should change. Oh no, she thinks that Kato is extremely attractive or very attractive, um, but he has a wife, so we will not be going there. But we probably will end up looking for some love interests because part of our challenge is we have to be quite a passionate sim in the romance area so I think she would be interested in dating around a little bit oh no don't take that he just took our fruit cake what the hell this is for us <laughs> come take a piece we'll see if we enjoy it all right rain is trying the fruit cake for the first time <gasps> what do you think she seemed to like it, but I don't have any moodlets, so I have no idea. Alrighty, I feel like we've sort of had the chance to meet our neighbors and settle in. I am going to cancel this welcome wagon, and I am going to head us over to the park next door, if I can come over. And we're going to come visit the park just by ourselves, and hopefully we will meet some new people. And I also think it would be good for her to come sit down and do her homework over here. So let's come take a seat, and we'll just do some homework for a little bit until some more people show up and I would love for her to make some friends that are also in uni or a similar age to her so we'll see what happens. Someone has come over, Billy Jang, oh she's a teen. Okay maybe not, I'm thinking I want to stick to being friends with young adults. <laughs> I guess we'll just keep doing our homework and wait a little bit longer. There is another teen here. Is this a teen hangout maybe? I'm not sure. All right, we're just about done with our homework. We, are, it's a little bit late. She's not super hungry, but she's a little bit tired. We obviously had that fruit cake before. I think I wanna head her over to like a bar or something to do some karaoke and to meet some people. And then we'll head home to bed for the night after that's done. Oh my God, cute. There's like a little table. You can come and sell things in the local park. That's so sweet, what? I love that. All right, so we've walked over to the next lot, which is this karaoke bar. I'm keen to get inside and to have a little bit of a sing on the karaoke machine. Okay, so we're pretty good at karaoke now. I'm gonna get her to sing some solo. Hopefully some more people will show up really soon and we can make some friends. Oh my gosh, guys, look how good she's gotten. <laughs> I love that for her. Oh, look! Kaori is here! Oh my gosh, she must be in town. Let's congratulate her on the engagement when we're done our little performance up here. Alright, now let's come downstairs and get a drink at the bar. Well, there's no one tending the bar, which is a little bit unfortunate. Are you the mixologist? No. Hello? Oh, Kiyoshi is the mixologist. Okay, can we... Come say hi to Kiyoshi and see if he can make us a drink. <laughs> what? Why is he just sitting there and not tending the bar? Oh, she's saying polite introduction. Oh, she got a sentiment with him. Oh, okay. Ooh, we think he's very attractive. Okay, well, I guess we'll keep an eye on him. We'll ask him about his career. We'll see if he's going to make us a drink. <laughs> if not, it's just good to get to know him. He's about the same age as us, I think, because he's a young adult now. Yeah, I think he's normally a teen when you start. Um, and so we we. So now he probably just aged up as well, didn't he? Yeah, he's five days into young adulthood. Okay, he's about the same age as us. I'm happy to become friends with Kate Kiyoshi, especially if he works as a bartender, because I feel like we'll be here all the time. All right, well, since he does not want to make drinks i suppose we'll just do some more of our homework we have class in 16 hours so <laughs> i need to get her to get onto the historical homework let's check that out now oh my god i thought it was a woman but it's akira 
<laughs> Sorry, Akira. I thought you were a woman. This guy fought with us. Oh my god, we had a- Oh no, he's a vampire! <gasps> Wait, where's he going? I don't know where that guy went. That was like a vampire because according to the rules, if someone is- Okay, he's over here. Alright, so <laughs> I think we're about to get into our first fight. No, stop leaving! Ambrose, what the hell, man? Come back. Okay. All right, so according to the rules, um, never go down without a fight. If anyone is negative towards you first, you must use at least three mean or mischievous interactions right away. But we don't actually know him and he's left. Oh crap, okay. So I guess we just invite him back over. Oh, he's sleeping. Don't worry guys, we'll find him. Next time he's around. <laughs> yeah, next time that guy's here, we will definitely be fighting him. I've got to remember to do that. Next time they're mean to us, we have to remember to do that. Alrighty then, it's getting pretty late and we're done our homework, really. We're almost done our homework, so once she finishes this off, I'm gonna send her home and send her to bed. She has definitely been a little bit of a social bug today, but I'm excited for her to go to uni tomorrow and smash out her first class. All right, we're back home now. It's still technically night out. So <laughs> I don't feel super bad about sending her to bed so early, but we definitely need to get some sleep. So straight to bed and tomorrow we'll clean up the rest of our needs. All right. Rain at Moon's university term begins today and will last for five weekdays. She should take a look at her class schedule and plan on when to do her homework and study, when to eat, and if there's enough time left, when to kick back and have some fun. All right, babes, she uh, really has to use the bathroom, like ASAP urgently, so <laughs> come use the toilet first, my love, and then we can sing in the shower and come and then make some... Actually, we did like the fruitcake, so you can come have that for breakfast as well. I'm pretty excited about her first day of university today. She has just one class, which we have completed the homework for, so we should be pretty perfect to do that. Oh no, what happened? Oh, you just stinky. Yeah, she does having her fruit cake. She also does need some fun. So I'm going to see if she would enjoy doing some boxing outside. I think she likes fitness, so she, it should get her fun up, but I'm just unsure. So we'll give it a go and we'll see. Yeah, that's definitely helping. Oh, bless. <laughs> All right, I'll let her have at it for a little bit. Oh no, what about family members passed away? I think that was like our grandmother or something. All right, she's off to her first day at university. I'm gonna get her to take some notes, work hard. We really wanna end up on a good grade. And I'll just clean up the house while she is away. I've also been thinking about what I'm gonna get her to do while she's at university. Obviously she needs to go into the politician career, but I don't want to get her to join it at a low level. I do want to wait until she finishes university to join. So in the meantime, I do need to get her to do some sort of work to get her income up because she only has less than 2000 simoleons and I know her bills are going to be much more than that. So I've been having a think and since she wants to become a politician or like a influence, I think we might take her down the writing career as well. I think it would just be nice to get her to do some writing or some programming even since she likes programming. Oh, she struggles with writing? Hmm. <laughs> she is a coding genius though. So I think I might get her to sign up to the um, freelancer career and then we might go down like the programming route then. I'm not too sure. We'll see. <laughs> okay, Rain is home from her first day of university. She doesn't have class anymore today, but she does have to write a term paper today as well. So I will get her to come upstairs and work on one of her term papers. Once she's finished writing her paper, I think I'm going to invite the girls over and start a club gathering at our house. I think it'd be so sweet to have them over to visit the lot and we can have a little bit of a party with them. I feel like that'd be really nice. We might also invite over some of our new friends. I don't really know who we have made good friends with. We chat with Billy a little bit. We liked her, Jana as well, but she's a little bit older than us. We really like Kato, but I don't want to go down that pathway. And we also got along pretty well with Kiyoshi last night at the bar. So I'm tempted to bring over some of these guys as well to get our friends to meet them, mingle a little bit, increase our friendship circle just slightly. We'll see. Okay, we finished our draft. I think that is fine for now. Oh, 
<laughs> Jana's already here. She's probably about to disappear, but we will start a club gathering. She's going to turn around and come over. Let's come and make a grand meal for everyone. We'll make a fish dinner. <laughs> We get to catch up with our girls. It is the TV season premiere. I don't think we have a TV, unfortunately, but that's okay. Maybe we can head over to the bar after dinner and we can watch it. All right, let's all grab a serving of this fish. We did a really good job cooking. Good for us. <laughs> Didn't burn the house down this time. Where's Stephanie? She come in? Oh, she was upstairs. I don't know what she was doing. Probably playing on our PC. All right, good job, girlies. And I'm just gonna send them over to the bar as well. And hopefully we can watch the TV season premiere. I really hope there's a TV there. If not, this will be such a waste of time, but that's okay. <laughs> okay, here we are at the bar. Please tell me there's a TV somewhere in here. I feel like there really should be a TV on the wall, but I'm having a look now and I actually don't think there is. Oh, there is. <gasps> yes, okay. I really want to complete this holiday. Okay, so she's watching it over here now. Oh, I love this outfit she's wearing. She looks so pretty. Ooh, our friend Kiyoshi's at the bar today. Oh, hi. Nice to meet you. Oh, we're just chatting with everyone. What are you sad about? Oh no, another grandparent passed away. I guess that's what happens. Did you watch the Llamas premiere, my love? Tradition complete. Okay, thank God. Woohoo! All right, let's come over and actually order a drink this time. Hi, Kayoshi. Good to see you again. We'll come say hi to him. Um, we'll ask him for some advice. You know, he's the bartender. <laughs> we'll ask him for some advice. Oh, okay. Ask about attractiveness preferences. No, that's weird. They're your siblings. Oh, all right. We're going to sit over here at the bar. Oh, my poor sad little Rain. Has she been crying? <gasps> She's either crying or sweating. I can't tell. All right, guys. It's getting pretty late. I am going to end the club gathering here, but it was really nice to see our friends again. Before they leave, I'll come and give them a little bit of a hug and ask them for some advice because they're a little bit down. Oh, Stephanie's really angry at Kyoshi for some reason. I don't think she likes him at all. <laughs> Poor Kyoshi, he's just the bartender. He did nothing wrong. We'll ask him for some advice as well. <laughs> all right, I think it's about time we head home now. Oh, we just became good friends with Kyoshi. All right then, let's go home. We have uni again tomorrow, so I want to get her nice and rested. Oh my gosh, love, you definitely got home in the morning today. This is a bad habit. <laughs> go to sleep, honey. You've got, you've got university in six hours. Oh my God. That's all right. We've got this and it's also Easter today. Wonderful. Oh, Axel's calling us. Yeah, we'll chat with you, bro. Good morning. Have a little bit of a chat with our brother. Oh, we've left our food on the floor. All right, <laughs> go eat your fish. <laughs> and off to class we go. We'll take notes again today. All right, Rain is back. She has class again in three hours. In the meantime, I am just going to get her to call up and join the freelance career as well. We meant to do that yesterday and I totally forgot about it. Okay, so let's enter the freelance career. And I'm thinking about getting her to become either a writer or a freelance programmer. I feel like a writer fits her story a little bit more, but she does like programming like she's good at it or we could become a photographer okay let's try programming because she likes it but if she doesn't i will swap her out for something a little bit more in her field i guess <laughs> brain is now checking for gigs for her job all right so these are all programming level one i'm gonna go for this one because it is the biggest pay even though it's still a pretty small pay but we just need to chat with our client Okay, we're just gonna repair this computer. Oh my God. Oh, she's got to go to university. All right. <laughs> Off you go, my love. Oh, organization events? <gasps> Ooh, okay. I wanna go to the debate guild. When's that, 16 hours? All right, we'll go to that tomorrow. Oh gosh, okay, whatever. <laughs> All right, the Festival of Light is on. I really wanna travel there. Oh, it's happening in our neighborhood? Oh, it's happening over here. <gasps> Oh, okay. Why don't we head over to the Festival of Light? Oh my gosh, this was definitely going to cheer us up. There's a little tree over here that we can hunt for eggs and also make a wish on. Yeah, let's definitely go do that. And we're hungry as well. 
Oh, poor Rain. Is there a vending machine around here? Let's purchase some drinks from the vending machine. We do actually need to for our aspiration. Okay. Um, I guess we'll get a protein bar because we're hungry. <laughs> uh, let's come eat this, bubs. Oh, and our friend Kiyoshi is here. Let's come say hi to Kiyoshi. Ask him about his day. How have you been, Kiyoshi? I feel like we've seen you every single day since we've been here. Oh, sweet. Oh, let's put a let's get a kimono to wear. I know it's a lot of money, but we've got a job now, so we will be able to earn that money back. Oh my gosh, look how pretty she is! Do you want to come take a selfie with Kiyoshi in your in your kimono? Besties! Oh my god, so cute. He really needs a makeover, though. Not gonna lie. Okay, maybe we'll quickly give Kiyoshi like a teeny tiny makeover what do you guys think i think we should we have good friends with him now all right <laughs> okay so this is updated kiyoshi i changed his eyebrows and i made his lips a little bit bigger but aside from that i kept his face the same i didn't change his eyes or his nose oh wait, i did change his nose i made the bridge at the top a little bit wider but it was just because it was really small but it's kiyoshi essence i think he is much more attractive now <laughs> let's head back into the game Okay, guys, now we can take a photo with him. See, that's better. He's so handsome now. Oh my god, look at these two besties. <laughs> oh my god, I love it. They're having such a good time. Aww. All right, guys, I think I'm going to end this episode here. I hope you liked the second episode of the Star Sign Legacy Challenge with our little Rain. We officially, finally moved to Mount Komorebi. We made some friends. We've been to uni. Everything is getting started. Please let me know what you think about me putting her in the programming freelance career. I think I would prefer to move her across to the writing or the photography but just based on her traits and her skills, I feel like the programming fit her better. But um, if you want me to change that or you think we should change it, let me know. Otherwise, I really, really appreciate you guys watching and all of your comments. Thank you so much for everything. If you did like this episode, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and also subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in the next one.